Hello, my name is Pratibha Verma. I graduated from IIT Delhi in 2014 from Engineering Physics branch. After that, I worked for two years in private sector and I started my preparation for civil services in 2016. I have scored 489th rank in civil services examination in my second attempt. I have scored 286 marks in physics optional. I came to know about DIAS and physics from my friends who had scored very well and I came to know that DIAS was providing the best guidance in physics and Vajpayee sir was a, was a legend when it came to physics optional. I have benefited immensely from Vajpayee sir, his guidance, his class notes and as well as from his test series. Because of all this, my preparation was pretty well and therefore I was managed to uh, score one of the best marks in physics and I thank him for all his guidance and his contribution towards my preparation. Thank you. Hi friends, my name is Anmol Jain. My Indian Forest Service is AIR 3 rank. My option physics and forestry. Tha. Uh, मैं अपना एक्सपीरियंस फिजिक्स में आप लोगों को बताना चाहूंगा फिजिक्स एक बहुत ही अच्छा ऑप्शनल है क्योंकि आप इसमें बहुत ही अच्छे नंबर लाए जा सकते हैं और पर्टिकुलरली स्टूडेंट्स जो इंजीनियरिंग फील्ड से हैं या फिर आईआईटी से जिन्होंने ग्रेजुएशन किया है उनके लिए ऑप्शनल बहुत ही अच्छा है मैंने अपनी क्लासेस डायस से करी थी जहां सिलेबस 3 से 4.5 महीनों में खत्म हो जाता है और अगर आप रेगुलरली इसकी प्रैक्टिस करते रहे 4 से 5 घंटा रोज तो आप बहुत ही अच्छे मार्क्स इसमें स्कोर कर सकते हैं ऑप्शन स्टैटिक है ज्यादा चेंजेस नहीं आने हैं सिलेबस में क्वेश्चंस पैटर्न वही रहता है हम मार्क्स अच्छे स्कोर कर सकते हैं हेलो एवरीवन माय नेम इज अनमोल जैन आई सिक्योर्ड ऑल इंडिया रैंक 3 इन इंडियन फॉरेस्ट सर्विसेज माय ऑप्शनल वेयर फिजिक्स एंड फॉरेस्ट्री आई वुड लाइक टू शेयर माय एक्सपीरियंस ऑफ टेकिंग फिजिक्स एज ऑप्शनल uh, physics is a very good option in a sense that you can score very high marks in physics after completing your uh, basic portion in physics and revising it. Uh, physics is good because it is a static subject. Uh, once you are done with the syllabus, you can score high marks. Uh, secondly, uh, physics for engineering students particularly and for students who have graduated from IITs is a very good option as they already have an edge over the option and they can again score very high marks in physics. Uh, I took, I started my preparation in 2014 and I did my classes in physics uh, from Dias Institute and uh, my course in physics was completed in around three, three and a half months or four months and it requires a preparation for four or five hours daily which is, which is very good for an option which can allow you to score more than 300 marks in CSE and even in forest services you can score very high. Hello everyone, my name is Deepak Babulal Karwa and I have finished my Metallurgical and Materials Engineering from IIT Madras in 2014. After that, I worked in an education startup for a year and started preparing for UPSC since 2015. In between, uh, to gain experience from an administrator's perspective, I did my Maharashtra Chief Minister's Fellowship in Tribal Development Department under the mentorship of Principal Secretary Ms. Manisha Verma Ma'am in 2017 for a year. Uh, this year I have secured 48th rank in civil services examination. Uh, this was my last attempt. This was my first and last UPSC interview. I had attended Vajpayee sir's physics class in Dias in 2015. Uh, so the moot point is why did I choose physics? So when I had started my UPSC preparation, I had to go through the same grind to choose an optional since my core subject optional was not available. So I had to explore multiple subjects. So my friends and seniors had told me a few pointers about how to choose an optional, which I will like to share with you. Firstly, you should preferably choose your graduation subject in which you have a basic background. Secondly, uh, before choosing an optional, you should see the previous year UPSC question papers and see your comfort level with the questions. And also you should develop interest in that subject. 
so you can study for long continuous hours so and also choosing uh, a science optional it gave me break from studying general studies all the time so i chose physics because i liked this subject since my 10th and it is very sub objective as well as static in nature so dias had provided me an excellent support to prepare physics through their tutorial sheets conduction of test series and class notes vajpayee sir's guidance through constant feedback on answers written after test discussion really helped me to improve my physics marks so there is a myth that science optionals are not good for upsc but this year i can tell you that at least four people came in top 65 of civil services examination with physics optional despite around 200 people appearing uh, in mains with physics optional so this comes around 1.7% of the total candidates so who all can choose physics optional a person with science or engineering background can choose physics as the basic understanding of physics is developed during their graduation and the major advantage of physics despite being vast is its static na nature and once you have command over it then you just have to keep on revising again and again the short notes and tutorial sheets to secure more than 300 marks in optional so once again i am really thankful to the dias team for all their support throughout my journey thank you vajpayee sir for your teaching and guidance Hello everyone. This is Dawa Singh. I secured rank 52 in PSC 2019. This was my first attempt. I had taken physics as my optional subject. First of all, I would like to thank Vajpayee sir, whose guidance has been instrumental in my physics preparation. Now, a few pointers that I considered while choosing the subject, and which I believe worked in my favor. Firstly, this was a subject that I was generally interested in. as would be the case for many students with engineering background secondly it's a static and objective subject thus making performance and preparation evaluation easier thirdly very good guidance is available in form of vajpayee sir's classes at dias whose students had scored about 330 marks in the past fourthly the subject of physics optional was very well defined and the way sir teaches the subject makes it very compact it was only because of this that i was able to complete the subject after prelims in just a matter of 3 months so if the above pointers make sense to you i would definitely recommend taking up physics as an optional subject for appearing for civil civil service examination thank you Hi everyone. Uh, my name is Ashima Goel, and this year I have secured uh, rank 65 in uh, UPSC Civil Services Examination 2019. And uh, I started preparing for UPSC examination in 2018, and uh, this was my second attempt. So my option was chemistry, and uh, uh, I think that has. Uh, all the marks are yet to come but uh, i think uh, chemistry as an optional has helped me uh, to get such a good rank uh, so there are i think two reasons why i would suggest anybody to take uh, chemistry as an optional if they feel comfortable as a uh, in chemistry as a subject is because one uh, it provides you diversity because uh, you cannot keep on studying general studies for uh, uh, for the general gs papers as well as for the optional papers so it provides you diversity sometimes if you don't feel like studying uh, gs general studies you can shift to a uh, chemistry to to chemistry or any other science optional for that matter so that is one thing and second is because as a science subject uh, this is a certain optional because uh, you can get good marks uh i think the highest that chemistry has given till now is 331 uh 
so that is one thing and uh, second is that uh, you you can whether you, what you write will directly replicate into how much you get so there is no subjectivity in uh, like the other papers so i think uh, these two things make chemistry a very favorable uh, optional and uh, i took coaching from uh, dais academy i took i used uh, notes of uh, rk singh sir of chemistry and uh, also i undertook uh, the evaluation and test series program of sir and i think that has actually helped me the helped me to furnish my uh, preparation of chemistry because uh, sometimes we feel we know enough but when we actually write it in the exam in that environment we actually get to know where we are heading and what kind of mistakes we are making and uh, in especially in mains in this examination how you write is very important you may know things but to present them in that particular way which helps to understand the examiner is very important and that is something that the of that the evaluation that and the feedback that i got from sir how to write the mechanisms in the second ex, second paper in which has organics uh, as a section so these become important and uh, lastly i would uh, like to just say uh, if you want if you feel you are comfortable in chemistry as a subject i think people should go for it because as i earlier said science one is it's a science subject and second provides diversity and uh, in i would uh, also like to share my strategy in detail uh, in a personal session so that may be held shortly thank you so much Hello everyone my name is uh, Anil Kumar Ratha and I belong to Morena Madhya Pradesh maine school hai yahan pe kari uske baad maine BTech IIT Delhi se kiya 2015 mein main pass out hua aur uske baad maine kafi seniors wagera se aur meri thodi ichha bhi thi UPSC preparation ki to wahan se inspire ho ke maine preparation shuru kari aur jab प्रपरेशन स्टार्टिंग में मैंने जोग्राफी ऑप्शनल ले रखा था तो फिर मुझे थोड़ा सा 2015 में मार्क्स कम मिले तो मैंने फिर ऑप्शनल चेंज करने का सोचा उसके बाद मेरे काफ़ी सीनियर्स ने मुझे गाइड किया कि केमिस्ट्री एक अच्छा ऑप्शनल है प्लस मुझे थोड़ा इंटरेस्ट भी रहा था ट्वेल्थ क्लास में जब मैं जेई की प्रपरेशन कर रहा था उसके बाद फिर मैंने केमिस्ट्री ऑप्शनल ले लिया तो थोड़ा मुझे ये भी फ़ायदा हुआ कि केमिस्ट्री मैंने डिसेंट स्कोर मैं कर रहा था इस बार मुझे उम्मीद है कि कभी ठीक ठाक स्कोर आया होगा लास्ट टाइम से और बेटर आया होगा और उसके अलावा कि सिंह सर ने भी काफ़ी हेल्प करी डाउट्स वगैरह क्लियर कर देते थे वो और केमिस्ट्री में जैसे कि टेस्ट सीरीज वगैरह जो लेते थे उसमें भी एवोल्यूशन टाइमली मिल जाता था मुझे तो, तो काफ़ी हेल्प हो गई उस चीज़ से और मतलब कुल मिला के जैसा था कि प्रैक्टिस हो गई इस बार लास्ट टाइम भी मतलब मेरी तैयारी ठीक थी बट थोड़ा सा लगता है कि टेस्ट सीरीज में थोड़ी प्रैक्टिस की कमी हुई मेरे से जिसकी वजह से मैं टाइमली कंप्लीट नहीं कर पाया था इस साल वो नहीं हुआ और मैं टाइमली कंप्लीट कर पाया पेपर तो काफ़ी हेल्प हो गई और ये है कि मतलब सर ने तो काफ़ी हेल्प करी ही और मैं फ्यूचर जो भी लोग केमिस्ट्री जैसे ऑप्शनल लेना चाहते हैं उनको बोलना चाहूँगा कि अभी थोड़ा सा यू का पैटर्न हल्का सा चेंज हो रहा है तो उन्हें थोड़ा बुक्स वगैरह भी पढ़ना पड़ेगा स्पेशली इन ऑर्गेनिक की बुक्स क्योंकि वहाँ से उन्होंने काफ़ी ज़्यादा क्वेश्चन पूछना स्टार्ट कर दिया गया है स्पेशली हुई आप रेफर कर सकते हैं क्योंकि अभी जो क्वेश्चन आ रहे हैं वहाँ से काफ़ी ज़्यादा आ रहे हैं और वो अनएक्सप्लोर्ड एरिया है सो so, बाकी फिज, फिजिकल और ऑर्गेनिक में तो सर जितना पढ़ाते हैं वो बहुत काफ़ी होता है थोड़ी बहुत बुक अगर रेफर करनी है तो आप कर सकते हैं वो बुक्स सर बता ही दिए होंगे आप लोगों को और मैं सर को थैंक यू बोलना चाहूँगा काफ़ी इस बार निकलने के ऊपर और थैंक यू थैंक यू एवरीवन